What is up guys, Freedom one and welcome to my live reaction to Dr. Stone Chapter 29, Senku's Lab. Alright guys, so last week, basically they created glass. And the week before that, we got lightning. Alright, so for those of you guys wondering where the hell have I been for the last two weeks, well, basically as you can tell from behind me, very different. Uh, I've had to move, um, I moved and then you know, obviously it took one weekend to move and the next weekend I had to set up and all that kind of jazz. So that's where the two weeks kind of pretty much went. Setting up, getting the computer back set up, uh, cleaned up, all that kind of jazz. But now everything's set, um, I'm set up, I've got everything ready, rocking and rolling. Um, basically I'm going to be here, I'm going to be rocking, rocking out with you guys every single week. Uh, and just, yeah, so basically everything now is going to be a lot more kind of set and a lot more boom, 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 which is good for me and obviously for you guys who have subscribed to my channel, you want a bit more consistency, now I can kind of give you guys that consistency, where before things were a bit more up in the air, now there's a bit more consistency and I can do that for you guys. But anyway, enough yapping, let's get straight into it, let's do this. Alright guys, so as always, if you want to follow along, bring it up on your tablet, PC, laptop, phone, whatever you like to read your manga on, read along with me because unfortunately I can't put it on the screen, which really does suck. I don't want to get pinned for copyright strikes and all that kind of shit, but let's just get straight into it guys. In order to make Rudy's medicine, this is where we must begin. Steadily, honestly working and collecting tools and utensils to create a lab. Go, 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 go. Now let us begin our exciting glass making class. Yeah, let's crank them out. All right, so it looks like we're, they're going to start making glass. All right. So yeah, last week they basically discovered they could, could make glass. So now we're going to start making it. I believe they actually made glasses last week from memory too. Okay. Whoa, there's some white bubble looking thing coming out of it. It's the same stuff. It's the same stuff that this charge from when obsidian bubbles and boils. Well, here, this here, we'll use this here for insulation to create our glass making furnace. Okay, fair enough. And then with an iron straw, we'll blow the glass and expand it. Alright, so I've actually seen this done in real life. Uh, when I went to Italy back in 97, so a long time ago, that, fuck, nearly 20 years ago, uh, I actually saw this getting done. They actually do still do it this way. They blow it up, they heat it up, and kind of get it all melty and gooey, and they actually blow into it and blow it up like a balloon. So this is all very accurate. Mm. Good, good, good. Well, it's only to be expected at first. When I learned to make earthen wares, it took me a few months to, sh to straight forward and steady on his work of making them. Okay, a few months? We don't have the time to kick back like that. What about Ruby's condition? Well, we don't have a glass artisan, so all we can do is, tr is uh, trial and error. Artisan? Right. So an artisan is basically like someone who who works with their hands basically. He's someone who creates stuff. Okay. Hey, hey, who the hell is this hold hold man? Okay. Mm -hmm. Knock it off with you, crumb. Who's old man, Kasaki? We need your uh, artisanal skills. Binding people up with straw rope for some hot bondage action is your way of asking people for help. I'm not gonna give one lick of help to a permit like you. Damn, I told you that's not what's going on here. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. <laughs> that's awesome. So he thinks it's like S&M type of thing. And Chrome's like, yeah, yeah, no, it's not that at all. Oh, man. It's like, it totally sick. Suki is mine. And she forgot to return the lacquer she borrowed. Oh, that's right. Well, she'll just go to the lacquer. Right, so that's a flashback. Was this old man the one that made that? that finely crafted shield. 
or without any iron tools or the last bit of dies. Yes, it was originally a gift to Kohaku's father, Kokuyo, when he won the last village games. I really put my all into making it. Ah, that takes me back. Okay. We would need incredibly high crafting skills to be on par with the level of our civilization. So I had been thinking about how we needed a masterful artisan, but I never thought it would be this old hobbling man here. The incredibly suspension, incredibly suspension breed, they must have been your work as well then. Yes, that's right. And you went and ripped out a plank, put it on your own? I'll never help the likes of you. No. Right. What's going on? What? What is this clear masonry work? He's like, <laughs> ah, I see. Well, if you don't want to help us, then you can just sit there and watch as we show you something real, real interesting. But Kaseki, I know that for you, I'm 10 billion percent sure, okay, that this will excite you. <laughs> Ooh, all right. When it gets heated, it changes its form and becomes soft, almost like fat. What a simple manufacturing process. All right, so he's watching how they're making the, the glass. Oh, crap. I ever blew it again. <laughs> yeah? What the hell are you doing? <laughs> Hello, he's getting cracking the shit. He's rolling it around to unevenly. He'll never make a clear, clean, even beautiful vessel like that. Let's say he's doing this all on purpose just to wind me up. Ah, damn it! <laughs> he's getting the shit. As a man who's dedicated and devoted to the craft, with the feet of glass making being dangled like drool before your very eyes, can you truly sit, sit still quietly there, old man Kaseki? No, of course not. Fine then. I can't resist at all. You got me. Ooh, all right, all right. So looks like they got an artisan. Nice, nice. Let me do it. Look at dude. He's fucking ripped. Whoa. Seriously? He's ripped? <laughs> I love it. So he's like, huh? <laughs> That's all I grab. Like, whoa. That's awesome, man. Suki, so, yeah, what up? Alright. Clank. Alright. <laughs> Crazy awesome! This is the first time Old Man Kaseki has ever seen glass, isn't it? <laughs> That's the difference in level of craft. I've been working as an artisan for 50 years now, so I'm rather skilled. This is something that exists no matter what the era. Someone who exists quietly, devoting their whole life to their work. A true man of skill. Nice. It looks like he's up, he's doing some roofing. It looks like he's doing a bit of everything. Chemistry lab acquired. Alright, so we've got another big thing. We've got electricity, now we've got glass, and a, a lab now. So now he can start mixing things up, which is going to allow him to come up with cures and obviously everything else that is required. Okay. Oh, what's wrong, Senku? We finally got our lab. You should be happier. Yeah, indeed, I am happy. Starting now, the sun rises on the dawn of chemistry. Things have finally become wonderful. Here, where we're filled with 10 billion times more fun, exciting attractions than Sukasa Land and the Kingdom of Science. Nice, nice. I like it. So now we've got a bit of a map here, guys. A science storehouse, a lab, a power plant, training grounds, ramen shop, iron making furnace, glass making furnace, an annealing oven, cooler. Okay, fair enough. We're gonna keep on going. Looks like we're going to the training ground. Man, it must be nice to be on the sorcery team. They're all sparkling and looking like they're having fun. Wish we were having fun. Hey, Kiro, what if? The tip of my spear was shining. Then even with your blurry eyes, you would be able to gauge the distance easier and practice better, right? What are you trying to say, Gino, you bastard? All right, so we know he uh, has bad eyesight, but he's refusing to take the glasses. How would we get a shiny spear tip? Oh, wait a second. How about a gold and silver spear? 
We really do need them, don't we? <laughs> I mean, after all, it's to to win the village games and all, so we really do need them, right? <laughs> He's like, huh? I have no idea about fighting at all. Is what they're saying for real? Sink so it, put it in your words, they're 10 billion percent just want a gold speed. Just look at all this glass. You've made such a wonderful laboratory. Surely you can make a silver spear, right? <laughs> That's right. Now that we've, we've created glassware, at last it's time to get the hardest ingredient from or the cure -all. And the only way to get it is to buckle down and dive right in. Very well. I shall make just a silver spear for you. Ah, too bad for you, Kinro, because I'm just a type that people feel sympathy for. <laughs> oh, that's nice. I don't have a single millimeter of sympathy for you. The price for the price for is high, high enough to die, Kinro. And truly, you may very well die in this maximum danger level area. You're gonna put your life on the line. The reward has the smell of danger. Next issue, next color cover. Huh? Alright, so that's the end of the chapter, guys. Pretty simple chapter, basically getting Artson, which is needed. Uh, he's then created all the glass and done a lot of the kind of handy type of work, which is good, which is what's needed. You know, uh, for this thing of science, so Senka could have his lab to now start creating everything else. Uh, so, yeah, we've got some good progress there. And overall, it's a pretty interesting thing. I'm curious about what this ingredient is for the cure-all that's in a very dangerous um, place. So I'm curious to see what that is. Um, and based on the price is, you want a silver spear? You do this for me, you get the silver spear. All right? So it's going to be interesting to see how this all plays out. But anyway, guys, that is all for me. As always, let me know in that comment section below what did you guys think of the chapter? Did you like it? Didn't like it? All that kind of jazz. And as always, guys, I'm Free No One. You guys are awesome. And I'll catch you guys with another live reaction. Peace. Hey, go! Run away! Run away! Oh,